Now, the government and Kenyans have been urged to invest more on identifying children's abilities and talents at an early age to avoid Western resources and time starting a cause they may drop in the future. This comes as the government continues with the implementation of the CBC curriculum. Secretary General of the World Talent Federation, Humphrey Obora, who hosted the Vice President of World Talent Federation, alongside other top officials of the Federation from USA, called on the government to invest on anthropobiometric machines, a career forecasting aiding kit. The machine is customized for scientific and professional talent assessment with career forecasting modules. And after interpretation by talent experts, they spoke at Staria Boy Center. You will not take your children to wade through and through guesswork. Up to university level, only for you to discover it was the wrong course. It is very bad, even for adults today. Our center here is focused on the child and assisting that child to become the best of uh, whatever uh, he's endowed with. These young boys are going to, well, they're going to raise a few more flags, I think, in future years. We've just lowered two here. Well, they're going to raise a hell of a lot more in future years. Had the national government, and I'm also now speaking as a government officer, even though from county government of Kisumu, had the national government sought the help of Professor Bora as they started, Without distop, distorting the idea, I can tell you CBC would have been a great success. They need to sort him again and we'll get it right.